Welcome to the Hustle Report by Jason Malone, presented by Clix Media. Shaquille O'Neal, also known as Shaq, is a former professional basketball player who has become a successful entrepreneur and investor. One of his areas of investment has been in the restaurant industry. Over the years, Shaq has invested in several restaurant chains, including Auntie Anne's, Papa John's, Five Guys, and Wingstop. He also has owned his own restaurant called Shaquille's, which has locations in Los Angeles, Atlanta, and Las Vegas. Shaquille has been drawn to investing in the restaurant industry because he enjoys food and believes that the industry has a lot of potential for growth. He has been attracted to restaurant chains that offer healthy and affordable options, as he is interested in promoting health and wellness. In addition to his financial investment, Shaq has been involved in the marketing and promotion of the restaurants he has invested in. He has appeared in commercials for Papa John's and Five Guys, and has used his social media platforms to promote the restaurants he is involved with. Overall, Shaq's involvement in the restaurant industry reflects his interest in entrepreneurship and his desire to promote healthy and affordable food options. Specific financial details of Shaquille O'Neal's investments in restaurant chains are not publicly available, as they are often considered private transactions. However, some reports suggest that Shaq's investments in these chains have been significant. For example, in 2019, Shaq announced that he had joined the board of directors for Papa John's and had become an investor in nine of the company's restaurants in the Atlanta area. It was also reported that he had received a stake in the company as part of his endorsement deal with them. Similarly, when Shaq invested in Auntie Anne's in 2016, it was reported that he had become a franchise owner and was planning to open several locations of the chain in the Atlanta area. In addition to these specific investments, Shaq has also been involved in larger investment deals through his partnerships with private equity firms. For example, in 2018, he partnered with a private equity firm to acquire the fast casual restaurant chain Big Chicken, which he had previously owned and operated as a standalone restaurant in Las Vegas. Overall, while the exact financial details of Shaq's investments in restaurant chains are not publicly available, it is clear that he has made significant investments in the industry and is seen as a valuable partner to many companies in the space. Shaq has diversified his investment portfolio beyond the restaurant industry and has made a number of notable investments in other areas. One area where Shaq has invested heavily is in real estate. He has owned and sold a number of properties over the years, including homes in Florida, California, and Arizona, and has also invested in commercial real estate properties. In addition, he has been involved in real estate development projects, including a partnership to build a luxury apartment complex in New Jersey. Shaq has also invested in technology companies such as Google and Apple, as well as in startups like Ring, a home security company that, has la that was later acquired by Amazon. He has also been involved in eSports, investing in NRG eSports and becoming a brand ambassador for the gaming company. In addition to these investments, Shaq has also been involved in a number of endorsement deals and partnerships with companies in various industries. For example, he has been a spokesperson for companies like Icy Hot, Gold Bond, and General Insurance. Overall, Shaq's investment portfolio reflects his diverse interests in business acumen. While he has had success in the restaurant industry, he has also made savvy investments in real estate, technology, and other areas. So let's talk a little bit more about some of the tech investments he's made. Shaq has been an early investor in a number of technology companies, including Google, Apple, and Ring. His involvement in these companies came about through a combination of his personal interests and relationships with other investors and entrepreneurs. In the case of Google, Shaq has said that he first learned about the company through a friend who worked there in the early days. He was immediately intrigued by the company's mission and the potential he saw in the search engine technology. He decided to invest in the company, which turned out to be a very lucrative decision as Google grew into one of the world's most valuable companies. Shaquille's investment in Apple also came about through a personal connection. 
He has said that he met Steve Jobs at a party in the late 1990s and was impressed by his vision for the company. He then decided to invest in Apple at the time, which was experiencing a resurgence under Jobs' leadership and has since been seen a significant return on his investment. More recently, Shaq became an early investor in Ring, a home security company that was acquired by Amazon for over $1 billion in 2018. Shaq has said that he was drawn to the company's mission and technology and that he saw potential for growth in the home security market. Overall, Shaq's involvement in these technology companies reflects his interest in entrepreneurship and his ability to identify promising investment opportunities. While he may not have the technical expertise of some of other investors, he has relied on his instincts and personal connections to make successful investments in the tech industry. The exact net worth of Shaquille O'Neal is difficult to estimate, as it depends on various factors such as his investments, assets, and liabilities. However, it is widely reported that he has a net worth in the hundreds of millions of dollars. His investments in restaurant chains, real estate, and technology companies, as well as his endorsement deals and media appearances, have contributed significantly to his net worth. Some reports suggest that his investments in Google and Apple alone could be worth tens of millions of dollars each. Additionally, Shaq has been involved in some very lucrative business deals over the years, including the sale of his stake in Vitamin Water when it was acquired by Coca-Cola in 2007. He also earned substantial income throughout his NBA career, as well as through his work as a sports analyst and television personality. Overall, while the exact size of Shaq's net worth is difficult to estimate, it is clear that he has been involved in numerous high value transactions and has built a significant fortune through his investments and business ventures. All right, guys, this episode was brought to you by Clicks Media, where we're focused on giving you the tools and information that you need so that you can launch and scale your business. At Clicks Media, we build websites, we build apps, we help you develop and create your content strategy so that you can build awareness for your brand. All right, guys, as always, thank you for tuning in and I will see you on the next episode.